let's suppose we know how much we can afford for a monthly car payment um, and we're curious about okay what how much can I get as a loan for that car um, we're framing this as a car loan but this could be true of other types of loans as well so let's use the TVM solver we'll go to apps hit enter for finance and enter for TVM solver in this case uh, we have a three-year loan so n is going to be three times 12 um, if the problem doesn't state that the APR is uh, compounded monthly it, we can uh, assume that it is in general um, there will be times where we have annual compounds but generally speaking most loans are going to compound monthly we're also going to have monthly payments so PY and CY payments per month compounds per month those should both both be 12 um, our interest in this case is 6.3 percent our present value is what we are interested in finding how much can I borrow right now if I can afford a monthly payment of 325 because it's a loan whatever that present value is the loan amount the future value should be zero because we're going to pay down that loan to zero the only other thing I'll say is our payments if we consider the payment to be positive and we solve for present value we'll see that the present value comes out as negative this is just about directionality right are we paying off the loan or is it the money that was coming toward us so we, we just have to think about one of these is going to be positive the other one's negative if instead I change the payment to negative we'll see that we get the same present value but without that negative on there so alpha enter we still get ten thousand um, plus dollars so ten thousand six hundred thirty five and forty nine cents if we're rounding so that's the amount that we're able to borrow right now based on how long our loan is the APR and our um, monthly payment that we can afford